Hey guys, it's Tim here, and today I'll be reviewing Done For You Prompt, which is a software that helps you to write with ChatGPT. It comes with Done For You Prompts, and it's a Chrome extension that you can use uh, in order to write all the stuff that you need. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to explain you all the details, going to show you a live demo. But before I do so, uh, check out the link in the description of this video. It will redirect you to my website where you can find more information. Also about the pricing here, you can simply click on these buttons to see the pricing, the upgrades, the special bundle deal, which gives you basically all of the upgrades and the front end for a discounted price. Uh, plus you're also going to get some extra free upgrades if you pick this up through my link. Simply click on one of these buttons, choose to go to the sales page or the special bundle deal page. And if you purchase this, you're going to get these free upgrades as well. All right, let's dive into this and let me show you uh, what Done For You Prompt is all about. Now, Done For You Prompt is an extension here. When you look at my browser here, you see this feather. When I click on this, it will open Done For You Prompt, which is basically a software uh, which is loaded with prompts that you can use to write inside of ChatGPT. Now, this helps you uh, preventing to think all the time rethink all the time what to write inside of ChatGPT when you want to write emails, when you want to write blog posts, etc. Done for you prompt comes with prompts. You only have to fill out a few keywords and then it will write the content for you. Now, as you can see here, I've opened done for you prompt and here it comes with specific categories. As you can see here, uh, it comes with ads, with content marketing, e-commerce, email, and some others, and also with custom ones. Now the custom one is an upgrade, which I highly recommend. And I will show you later how that works because this will save you a ton of time. Uh, but let's say you want to do some content marketing. You simply click on content marketing and look at this. It will show you all the available prompts for content marketing. Now it works super easy. If you want to write something with chat GPT, uh, simply choose one of these options. So let's say you want to create a post from a title, you simply click on this, send this preset to ChatGPT, and then the only thing that you need to do is to fill out what you wanna write about. So let's say I wanna write about a dog, a five week dog training, five week dog training. And I'm gonna click on okay, and ChatGPT will now automatically start writing a article about a five week dog training. Now this is just one of the prompts that comes with done for you prompt and it comes with a lot of prompts. And of course you can, it's not only for dog training, you can use this to create anything, you know, you can write a blog post about anything. And as you can see here in the background, it's writing this blog post. So here you can see, write a blog post from the title five week dog training. And here, boom, the blog post is done for you. Now, if you wanna write emails for this dog training, you simply open the done for you prompt again. And then within the category, you choose emails. So here you can say, I wanna choose emails because I wanna write emails. And then let's say I want to use here uh, a cold email. I want to write a cold email. So I'm going to choose this one. And what is my product service? My product service is a five week dog training. And here my audience are dog owners. So I only have to fill out these two things in here, my products and service and my audience. I'm going to click OK. And boom, now ChatGPT is writing an email for me to invite them uh, a cold email to join my five week dog training. And again, this can be for any product, of course, but this is just an example. And here, this is the email that I can use and it has been written automatically uh, with done for you prompt. As you can see, super easy. If you want to continue, simply click on done for you prompt again, and you can choose from these categories in here. Now, what you also can do here, if you have some favorites, if you like to use one multiple times, you simply click on this star here and that will add your prompt to your favorites, as you can see here. So these are the ones that you're using often, right? But then there's one of the upgrades which I really like and I highly recommend. And that is this one. This is the custom one. Now the custom one means that you can create your own prompts. So when I click on this plus here, 
I can create my own prompt. Now, I've created something here in the back. I have a text document here. So let's say I want to create this prompt. This is a prompt that I created and that I want to use multiple times. And this is, for example, an email campaign to convince to sign up for my program. So what I'm going to do here, oh, shoot. I'm going to do here email. Let's call it Tim's email. Uh, Tim's email convincing uh, Vin Singh to sign up. This is the name of my prompt so that I can find it. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to paste my prompt in here. I'm going to give this as a description as well. So I'm going to do the same description. And this is my prompt here. So as you can see, I'm looking for a type of email that will convince my ideal customer persona to sign up for my program subscription by explaining the value it brings and the benefits they receive. Now, what you can see here within brackets, I'm going to copy this because I'm going to make custom fields here, placeholders. I'm going to paste it in here, a type of email. And I'm going to call this a friendly email. So this is an example. This is a placeholder. And you'll 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 understand once I show you uh, within a second. I'm going to paste it in here as well. What I'm simply going to do is everything within the brackets here, so this ideal customer persona, is going to re be replaced whatever you type. So I'm going to place this in here, and then my third bracket here, my program subscription here, I'm going to create a placeholder as well. So remember here, Tim's email convincing to sign up. I'm going to save this one. And now I'm going to my custom here, not my favorite, show all. And in here, it says Tim's email convincing to sign up. Do you see this? When I click on send this preset to ChatGPT, look at this. This is the prompt that I created. This is a preset that I created myself. So if you have prompts that you're using all the time, like I'm sending a lot of emails, what I can do is I can create my custom prompt that I'm using all the time inside, inside of ChatGPT so that I don't have to remember or have to rewrite it myself. I simply open done for you prompt and I fill out these three fields. So here, remember a friendly email, which I did as a pre-typed field. So I'm going to do a friendly, a friendly email. And look what happens here. When I press OK, here, the ideal customer persona is, of course, dog owners. And then the program subscription is a five-week dog training because that's what I want to sell here. So when I press OK here, it's going to write inside of ChatGPT with my done-for-you prompts that I already filled out up front. And here it's going to write that email for me. And look at this in the back end. And once it's ready, it's also ready in here. Then I can copy my text. And there it is, boom. I'm looking for, you see that? A friendly email that will convince my dog owners to sign up for my five-week dog training by explaining the value it brings and the benefits they'll receive. And here is the email done for you inside of ChatGPT. I can simply copy this or I can repeat this prompt so that it writes a new prompt again. And that's how easy it is with done for you prompt. It's a, a powerful ChatGPT uh, browser extension that you can use here to write anything you like in all these categories in here uh, or with the presets that you've filled out. You simply choose one. You simply click this, send to ChatGPT, uh, type whatever you want here, docs, boom, and it's going to write the content for you. It's that easy. So again, if you're interested, make sure check out the link in the description. Uh, if you have any questions, make sure to ask them in the comments below. I'll be more than happy to answer them. And uh, please hit a thumbs up if this video was useful. Consider subscribing to my YouTube channel if you haven't done yet. Uh, I do a lot of similar reviews, product reviews, software reviews. And uh, that's it for today. You can see here the results as well for the latest one. And uh, thank you so much for watching. And I hope to see you in my next video. Talk soon. Cheers.